Reckon there's even more bodies beneath all this sand. Way to keep it light, Files. Another door. Help me. This must be the place. Let's get some light in here. on the other side of that glass. Anyone gonna hit the lights? Can't see fuck all. At least. And I'd say we found the rocket hangar. Maybe I need new glasses, but I'm not seeing any rocket. Paddock, buried. The hangar's empty. Well, shit. If the rocket was moved, there's gotta be a record of it. You know what? Hack into an access port. Let's see if Jack can bypass that virus. Okay, Jack. Let's pull some records. Okay, Jack's giving me a window into the mainframe. Ooh, that's some nasty malware. Adaptive. Semi-sentient. Don't worry. Jack's got this. Right, buddy? <laughs> huh. No virus to stop, Jack. Huh, data's coming in. Got it. I assume you can read this? Yes, but much of it is encrypted. Okay, the rocket's nose cone is close. Check the assembly chamber on the other side of the hangar. Nose cone? What about the rocket? The hammer satellites are part of the nose cone. Go deal with that, and we'll keep digging on the rocket's location. Wilco, Delta out. All right, let's go find those satellites. Boss, we're bad, sorry. Did you read those files? Nah, I was born in New Ethera. My parents wouldn't even speak as scary with me growing up. They didn't want to see me in this. They could have hidden half a city in here. Massive. Yeah. Don't envy whoever had to build it.
Okay, boss. Take us across. With pleasure. One thing, Joe. I mentioned how the UIR attacked that facility and tried to launch our Hammer of Dawn satellites. Yeah? I led that attack. Did? Why? To destroy the car. Yeah, well, that makes sense. Uh, these days, I'm somewhat less interested in destroying the cog. Good to know, Paddock. Okay, let's go. Guys, go to the satellites, back here. This way to the satellites. Give me a hand. Well, no satellites here. Let's keep looking. Paddock, I'm curious. How long did your siege against this place last? Three days. We attacked the moment Premier Deshinko sat down with your chairman to discuss the armistice. You hit us with the hammer first. We thought it was only fair to hit back. Okay. hammered you 50 years ago isn't us. We're not them. Well, if you lost those satellites, you'll be doomed to make the same mistakes. What is this knob even on about? Before Paddock starts talking again. I heard that.
time! Yourself. But now you're saying it's a mistake. What gives? You launch, you buy us some time, but eventually they'll win. You must know this. No, I don't. <clears throat> Doors welded shut. Then that's the door you want. Jack, rip that door. Mm -hmm. Here we go. All right, let's get set up. They're coming.
Almost certainly. A handful. And another news. Got the door open. Good job. <laughs> Just realized if my parents hadn't have left Vascar, my dad might have been here fighting off Paddock's men. You, Vascari. What did your father do? He was a surgeon. <laughs> then he was lucky. We shot every doctor we captured. Uh, can we turn him off? Okay, should be through here. Grab the other side. Gotcha. We found the nose cone. Oh man, but it's missing satellites. Wait. I see the others. Either side of the train. Let's get on that gantry. We'll load them up one at a time. Good idea. I'll drive. Bring the gantry in closer, Jack. Just like the last one. Make the call. Choices, choices. All right, off we go then. Um, uh, having a problem, pal? No, just figure it out. So our friend Pat has got some uh, interesting thoughts on the Hammer of Dawn. <laughs> Who's he to judge? He tried to launch it himself. Okay, let's get that thing loaded onto the nose car. Bullets is stuck. Maybe it just needs a nudge. Okay, okay. Maybe it needs more of a shove.
gotta get off this thing! Well, there's a hard platform to the left! Hang on! Okay, let's go. Brace yourselves, this might be a little rough. Hey, what if Paddock's right about launching the satellites? Oh shit! More on the other platform! Brace yourselves, this might be a little rough. Hey, what if Paddock's right about launching the satellites? Oh shit! More on the other platform! Oh, 
so we can connect the satellite. Let's get this done. Swimmingly? Uh, no comment. Look for another switch. Just like the other one. There. Watch your head. Here comes satellite number two. Bot's having some trouble, mate. Reboot it. Satellite secure. Back onto the gantry. Let's get him to the hangar. Uh, not to burst any bubbles, but we're not getting anywhere till we open that big round door. Ugh. Well, there's a platform up there. Head over to it. You read my mind. All aboard! Okay, let's get up there. He's right through the hammer's dangerous. Believe me, get that done. Not launching these satellites is dangerous. Believe me, a world on fire is better than the world you want. We get this thing back to the hangar. We 
worry about the rest later. Let's try this.
They're down. Let's keep it moving, Delta. burst apart like that. Yeah, pretty much. Our way out's above us. Let's get up there. Ever would be so difficult. Hmm. Assistant scientists, rocket scientists, and anyone who's used the expression, it's not rocket science. What do you think? We just push a button mark to launch? Oh, awesome. Yeah, pick on the handsome one, cut him down to size. So, we're back across. And for the record, <laughs> I'm the handsome one, okay? Paddock, we're almost out of here. Any leads on that rocket? Yes. It's at a turntable in the east, beyond the Dune Sea. There's a rail bridge blocking the way, but don't worry. My people will raise it for you. So, out in the desert, find train tracks. Then you'll know you're on the right path. Copy that. All right, let's head for the skiff. You know, all this time I thought I was the answer. Oh, dear God.
still there? I got a question for you. No, I'm on launch break. Of course I'm still here. Okay, what exactly stops you from launching the hammer? The usual problems faced by 200 dedicated patriots trying to defeat 3,000 cowards. You know, you could just have agreed to the armistice. And spared a lot of lives. A Groznian proverb for you. A just war is better than an unjust peace. So, just exactly how many Garazian proverbs justify war? Eh, most of them. Alright, let's head out. Children, one more thing. The bridge controls one network, so the base commander's virus didn't affect them. But the bridge itself hasn't been lifted in decades. What do you say? You worried about your people not being able to raise it? No, they'll handle it. But that bridge is old and rusty and... Uh, just, when you're beneath it, don't linger. Copy that. All right, you heard him. Let's head for the bridge. So, this patch... How does Baird even know him? Apparently, Paddock served in the COG for a while. That guy was COG. When? Unclear. They didn't seem that eager to talk about it either. Long before I was born, mate. 